Hey, Kathleen O'Leary. Tonight after Bay Treasure, Governor Brown. When we come back, a flossing daily could increase your lifespan by five years, but what you can do to increase it by 14 years. Then, a bombshell initiative why lawmakers could allow children to smoke medical marijuana. I don't know who, whose idea it was, but we decided to kill ourselves. Oh, the emotional interviews with Bernie Madoff's wife and son, their message for their father and his victims when we come back. And when we come back, Facebook is doing more than keeping friends in touch. A new app that's getting widespread praise. But first. There are new clues tonight into what may have caused a deadly crash and an air show. Then. When we come back, one of the most popular airlines in the world is going on strike. And a couple walks into a supermarket with their three-year-old daughter. On their way out, both are arrested and the baby is taken away. We'll have that story next. So did the U.S. enter another war where President Obama sent more than 100 troops? Then Twitter backlash for some local leaders. What a San Diego politician tweeted about the Democratic Party. Three horses found in Spring Valley, severely malnourished. Find a new home. We show you coming up. Cancel takeoff, cancel takeoff plans. Heavy is A disturbing new report Four involving airplanes. Right Why the number of mistakes is on a dramatic rise. Hi everyone, I'm Kyle Hunter. The clouds and fog have rolled into San Diego and the weekend's here. I've got your forecast coming up. Aloha, when we come back, not everyone was a fan of the president's visit to Southern California. We'll let you hear what one heckler yelled at the commander in chief. 911, what's the address of the emergency? Oh, we're on the boat right now. Um, our friend has gotten hit by a shark. You know, the dramatic 911 calls of a shark attack have been released. How the victim's quick thinking may have saved his life. Plus, are the Chargers one step closer to getting their new stadium? How Governor Jerry Brown's actions today could help. Then, talk about a great ball of fire, how this inferno is created, and when you can see it at the Miramar Air Show. Plus, if you're drunk, you can end up in jail or end up in here. We'll tell you how a center in Escondido is helping out the community. Straight ahead, a big speed bump in the race for the White House. Coming up, which candidate's campaign manager unexpectedly quits? We'll be right back. When we come back, a popular fruit found in most homes is being recalled. What it is and how to protect yourself. But first. It's respectful to say bless you. A California teacher penalizing students who say God bless you. His explanation and why it has nothing to do with religion. Plus. The Miramar Air Show is this weekend. An inside peek into one of the most anticipated events of the year. And speaking of big events, we're at a big one tonight, the Gaslam Theater, the San Diego Film Festival, celebrating 10 years. We're on the red carpet, coming up. Thank you very much. When we come back, there are several bills on the governor's desk. Some of them are packing some heat. We'll tell you what it means for those who want to carry a gun. And giving new meaning to the term fast and furious, what is the fastest car on the market right now? Start your engines. We'll have it for you coming up after the break. Fox 5 News at 10. We're back in a moment. And trick-or-treaters, be warned, there is more than just sugar in those candy bars. We'll tell you about that. And speaking of Halloween, send us your costume it pictures. Just go to fox5sandiego.com. It was a graveyard smash. He did the match. It caught on in a flash. He did the match. He did the monster match. From my laboratory in the castle east To the master bedroom where the vampires feast The ghouls all came from their humble abode To get a...